hey guys welcome to my channel so i have a website which i created welcome to my website it's moneyritika.xyz but there is no https and in this video i'm going to set up https for myself so let me ssh into my server and let me open tmux for fun here you can see that i'm in my server so how to make this https first of all when you type https so let me try to type https here so it's a secure connection there is no response it seems like something is blocking the response which is my port so ufw you want to firefall allow 443 because when you make an http request it comes to port number 443 so press enter again as you can see there is nothing which is listening to this port now i have a web server running let me type as a system ctl status nginx but as you can see this uh, web server is just listening to port 80 because that's how i configured it so open my site configuration so here uh, in this configuration i'm just listening to port 80 i'm not listening to port 443 okay so how to set up ssh for setting up ssh you have to create some ssh certificates in your computer to make all this thing simpler so the program is apt get install python 3 cert bot nginx now this package helps you to set up a cert bot or you know https certificates for your nginx website which is running pretty easily all right so i'm going to install this but i'm going to explain like how these things work and uh, it's uh, not very hard but if you get into the things like certificate authority and stuff and try to find out more knowledge then it's actually a little bit tricky so here as you can see the tool is installed now all i have to do is cert bot hyphen hyphen nginx and this is going to change my configuration which i just showed you for nginx uh, and we'll look into it later so what this hyphen hyphen nginx will do it will look for all the running website and it will fetch the domains from it so right now it's just moneyrithika.xyz but if you are running some other website with some other domain it will fetch it and then it will generate a certificate for it let me press enter and as you can see enter an email so you you can give some you know temp email or anything it doesn't matter and then do yes for terms and services so which name would you like to activate your https for right now i have only one website running with uh, moneyrithika.xyz so it's just giving me one option so let me type one and press enter and now it's generating the certificates and it's also changing my configurations of nginx and installing like doing all the settings which is required for those certificates okay it deployed the certificate basically it's done okay so where are my certificates well we'll see that but first let me open the configurations again so my site and so oh my god it added so much dirt and as you can see it also added the comments that managed by cert bot so this line is actually managed by cert bot but i want to remove all this like it's not needed and as you can see it uh, the stupid program doesn't even do indentation properly or i think i <laughs> my indentations are wrong or something let me remove all this uh, managed by cert bot okay i don't know why i'm doing it one by one manually uh i want to do the tabs correct okay it's not correct but it's fine so now we are listening to 443 previously i had just listened to 80 but now it's removed it's down there here so what cert bot did is so it's basically redirecting so if anybody try to uh, go to moneyrithika.xyz so it will basically 304 it will redirect it to https basically this code is redundant now like there is we are not even listening to port 80 now we can just remove it get rid of it now because every time we try to access port 80 without https it's basically going to redirect us to https which is actually a good practice i like this some people don't like this some people to basically allow users of website to choose whatever if somebody don't want to use https then you can just allow him so yeah that's all it did but what are these lines okay so it's listening to 443 but what are these lines so this is basically the path of the certificate okay so you can just generate this certificate and do this configuration configuration manually by yourself with cert bot 2 if you want it also added some configuration which is needed and this is something i don't know i don't want to get too much into detail yeah you can just use cert bot standalone something like that and i'm not going to tell you this thing but uh, yeah i did this for plenty of time for my email server and some other things where you are not using nginx you can just generate your certificate and use that we'll do, do this kind of things in future when we set up some irc bouncer or something all of this is done let's uh, system ctl restart nginx 
and let me go to this website and to refresh so now as you can see https is working and if i try to go to http it will redirect okay it doesn't redirect why maybe because ah i know why because i did some mistake i removed that code because i thought it's uh, stupid we don't need it but we actually need it so what was happening is uh, when i'm going to port 80 nothing is uh, so i have to add add listen 80 so basically the logic comes here if you are not able to understand this then it's pretty simple just don't do anything just let the let the cert board do the thing don't change configuration all right seems correct so enter server name to money with dot xyz it's always hard to type let me save it and system ctl it's always good if you understand things uh, so you can do some configurations by yourself i did some mistake and i didn't even run nginx hyphen 2 t to look at the mistake so on line number 24 i did some mistake let me just quickly open my site and go set line number 24 ah, i forgot semicolon here fucking c programming all right uh, now nginx is working let me refresh and it redirected to https so there was nothing which was listening to port 80 so don't be an idiot don't remove what sort what provide and thanks for watching this video i know this wasn't a good explanation but i believe in you you will figure out some way and make things work I've been feeling so, I've been feeling so down, yeah Can you tell me why, can you tell me why I'm down, yeah No friends of mine, no friends of mine around, yeah Now I'm thinking now, now I'm thinking now